All right, I want to bring in Eva Believer, who joins us from our newsroom studio here in London. Uh, and you are a plus size model. What's it like in the fashion industry for models like you? Your size is around it. It's about, about 18 to 20, isn't it, Eva? Yes, good morning. Good morning. Uh, well, first of all, I would like to use this opportunity and to express uh, my respect and gratefulness uh, for England as a country because it's not a secret. I'm not English. I'm not even British. I came from European country where unfortunately plus size industry does not exist. There's a zero shops in the high streets or shopping centers. There's no catwalk shows. There's no designers. So basically when I lived in my country seven years ago, I left. Um, I had even my t-shirts done with my seamstress because there's no plus size clothing. Size 16 might be the biggest and of course is almost smaller than for example uh, plus size retailers would do. Uh, so I'm very happy and I congratulate England because this is a very good platform for plus size model like myself. Uh, but in general, um, speaking in general, I would like to ask and respond to the question, uh, what is the fashion? Uh, fashion's purpose is not to promote, is to represent. And if today we have an average dress size, a woman average dress size 16, why would we see the skinny models on the catwalk? I mean, it doesn't represent the average woman. So I count myself as an average size, 18 to 20, well, a bit bigger than 16, yeah. And uh, I feel that we need this kind of thing. We need to see women who represent the real woman in real life in the streets. But, but and, Eva, sorry to interrupt, but both Carla and Peter are saying it's not about a repre fair representation in society. It is about art. And what the designers are doing is finding the best canvas to represent their art. And that happens to be smaller models. Yes, I understand. You know, I have myself master's degree in performing arts and I know that uh, fashion is art. But then is again a very big purpose to create art for the much bigger women because, you know, um, I have issues with the other plus size models sometimes. We just discuss things like that. That yes, we have plus size brands, but um, talking about the quality, about the arts, about the, you know, fashion itself for the plus size, Sometimes we can't compare, we can't compete with okay. a straight size fashion because as an art is not developed enough. So that's why we need to have big models on the catwalk with the properly developed designers labels and, uh, you know, just to go forward with that. Eva, thank you. Chelsea?